Folks just finishing up their work week, making their way into Rogers Center here in Toronto. Tonight, game two of this four-game weekend set. Digging in, Melky Cabrera having a very nice year, currently second in the American League in batting average entering play. Harold Reynolds, we look at the Royals as they enter play here tonight. They came out on the losing end last time out and are in a bit of a skid. In fact, they've lost seven of their last ten. Yeah, Matt, I mean, nobody likes to lose game one of the road trip, but you go on the road thinking, hey, if we can play 500 for the full road trip, we're in good standing. So right now you're in game two of the road trip, and you know what? If you win today, you're what? 500. So you're actually on goal. That's why this game is a big one for you to be on point. With that, let's take a look at the Blue Jays' starting lineup. Dan Plezak, who are you focused on? Well, Matt, they have to expect that Josh Donaldson is going to step up soon. I mean, this is a guy that hit over 320 last season. So it's definitely surprising to see his average where it is right now. It's still early, though, so I do think he can come out of this. He just needs to string some good games together. Well, he's out in front of that breaking ball right there. Not surprised. I was after that fastball. Nice job of pitching. Kind of keeping him off balance. Another foul ball, and this battle will continue. And a swing and a miss as they got him with the slider there, two away. One thing to know is not all strikeouts are created equal. Right there, he goes down on strikes, but he really made that guy on the mound work for it. And when you're doing that in the first inning, it can have an effect on how deep he's going to be able to go into the start. There's a big difference between that and going down on three or four pitches. Grounder down the line at third. And the inning will continue as that's through for a two-out hit. Well, a couple things with that base hit right there by the three-hitter. One, he thought he was going to get out of this inning pretty easy. And now you put him in a stretch. The middle of this lineup is no joke. He can find himself in danger real quick. Mark Canna is at the plate now, and he's quickly behind 0-1. And this ball is heading for the seats down the right side as the count will move to 0-2 now. Ready with another 0-2. That misses 1-2. Two out with the man at first. Swung on and missed, and that's the final out of the inning. Nothing in the Toronto. Leading off with the Jays. That's popped up. Out towards short Troy. right field. Two Harrison is there for it. One out. Digging in the switch hitter. Freddie Galvis, not the shiniest of batting average as he comes Freddie. in hitting down in the 220s Galvez. for the year. That pitch is in triple digits. I think he had to take that one because I'm not even sure he saw it. And a half-hearted attempt that time, but they'll say he broke the plane, and that's out number two. First pitch on Coming its way. Seven. Craig Daly Craig is in with two away Daly. now as he looks at a called strike one. That's a high Three strike right. on a curveball right, right there. If he continues to throw that pitch, we won't be mentioning his name. Threw it right past him, a swing and a miss at the gas, and that ends the inning. So the catcher, Jared Salta Lamaki, is in Toronto. now, hitting just catcher a bit Gira. over the Mendoza line on the year. And that swung on and missed for strike one. Oh, good knuckle curve, 0 and 2. The wind up and the 0 2 pitch. And this is fouled at the plate. Well, I think he's trying to get that two-strike fastball out of the zone. Just caught too much of the plate right there. Fortunately, he fouled it off instead of putting it in the seats. And he lays Outside, off it to even the count two and two. He went with the off speed there once he got him to 0 and 2. But now that they both missed, I think we'll see more of a challenge pitch here. You don't have to give in, but you can't be too cute either. Got him swinging on the fastball nine. there. Jared Saltalamacchia is dealt Darwin with for the first Barney. out in the bottom of the inning. Darwin Barney oh, comes on with one away as he looks at a ball. It's 1-0. Oh. Oh, much too tardy on the fastball. 1-1. One one. Boy, he center cut that fastball. It comes in oh, in the high 90s, track. but that's a dangerous location no matter how hard you're throwing. And this is fouled back and out of play. Well, that's back-to-back -back breaking balls. He's able to foul that one off. Will they come back with a third? 
And he misses this one inside, and that'll run things full three and two. Up, 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 and here's a ball hit room, in the got air. Room, got room. Perez is under it, two gone. That's exactly what they wanted out of that pitch up in the zone. They took him up the ladder, and he couldn't get up to it. So that was an easy pop out. Well executed well, pitch there. Here's Melky Cabrera. He Melky swings and sends Cabrera. it in the air to right center field. And Gordon will make the catch to retire the side. Digging in to try it again. Kevin Leading Pillar. 0 for 1 for him oh, here in this Kevin one. Fielder. Thought he had Kevin the inside corner Pillar. that time, but it missed for ball one. And a good heater as he just watches this baby a ball and a strike. No outs. No outs now. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch fouled back looking to punch him out again the pitch fastball swung on and missed for the first out digging in for his second at bat Josh Donaldson he reached on a single in his first try no runs just one hit and no errors in the game for Toronto grounder hit hard down the first baseline a dive but he can't get a glove on it it's through for a base hit Throw into second, but he'll be in there with a double. So a good job of going the other way here as he checks in with the one-out double. And as we check out the ranking on the team leaderboard, you can see that that gives him an even 20 now on the campaign. Throw on to first, two gone. So striding in, Troy Tulowitzki, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. Strike two at a pitch that catches the outside corner. Not a bad pitch there with two strikes, but it misses one and two. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. And he struck him out, his eighth punch out of the ball game, and that one in. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Freddie Galvis. He'll start things out here in the home fifth, and it's been tough sledding for this lineup through the first half of the game. Yeah, they haven't had any momentum going to the plate so far in this one, Matt. They need something to break their way and wake them up a bit. Be nice to get these fans involved at some point as well. Now batting. Craig Daly is in for his second plate Daly. appearance as he looks at a ball. It's 1-0. and oh. Out of play off to the right. It's 1-1. One and one. one out, nobody on. Hey. Takes a fastball on the inside corner. Plays one now. And he punches out another one. Make it nine for the ball game. Ready now. Jared Saltalamacchia. He's 0 for 1 thus far. In there. 0 and 1. And there's ball 1. Ready with the 1-1 pitch. Right on the corner, a fastball that he here. takes for a strike. Boy, Matt, he's in some kind of groove, and they better get something working because he is one pitch away from throwing Take five shutout innings. Talk about dominant work so far. Again, he sends it out of play. Now here's the pitch. And he will strike him out. Ten now in the ball game, and the inning is over. Coming to the plate now, Darwin Barney. He'll start things out in the Toronto. sixth for a lineup Second that really baseline. hasn't found its groove Darwin in this one. Barney. Yeah, only two hits so far, Matt, and not very many hard hit balls either. We'll see if they can start making some adjustments. The windup and the 0-2 pitch. And he looks at a ball, one and two. The one and two pitch. And now a pitch hit sharply on the ground. But this is a foul ball as the count holds steady at one and two. And he struck him out. And there's strikeout number 11 in the ball game. Striding in once again, Melky Cabrera. He started out the evening 0 for 2 so far. In there for strike one, 0 and 1. Off the plate, one ball, one strike. And now that Royals bullpen will get busy as we see both the southpaw and a right-hander get loose. On to first, and Cabrera's a ground out victim. Two away. Ready for another shot now. Kevin Pilar. 0 for 2 Center with a couple Fielder. of strikeouts for him Kevin so far. Pilar. Into the windup and the pitch. 
And this will get over his outstretched glove. A great effort there, but it's a base hit. Eat it, eat and it. he'll make it to second base now with two gone. Finally, a little something for them to get excited about. Yeah, a rally can begin with a single swing of the bat. Three, this might Charge. be their chance right Donaldson. here. They've struggled to produce a lot of runs, but there he is at second base. A shot to the outfield scores him. Then who knows what kind of roll hey, they can two, get on. Got to take it one good at bat at a time. And he misses there, one and two. Hey, I know you have to protect the strike zone when you get the count to two strikes, but on an 0-2 pitch that misses by that ball, much, ball, it's ball. pretty. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end. So now it's Mark Canna, third trip Leading to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for Third's 2 at this point. Mark There's a knee-high pitch that catches the zone. Hits this one hard the other way. Backhanded. Throw to first is in time for the first out. Here's Troy Tulowitzki now. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Hit back up the middle. Oh, and he has some trouble with it. And he will recover in time to get it over to first. Nicely done there as they record the second out. A couple of righties starting to loosen now in the bullpen. The batter number 13, Freddie Galvis, Galvis, is in for the third time now as he takes Galvis. a called strike. It's 0-1. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. Oh, look at the sliding stop. Got him. Ready once again, Craig Daly. Leading He'll lead things Toronto. off here in this one-run right contest. Craig and a fastball Daly. just a bit up. Yeah. And it's a called strike to even the count at one. Guys, I've been really impressed with him tonight. I mean, he's carving these guys up with all of his pitches. He struck him out the third time he's fanned in the game. So you've got to figure he's got a good chance here to finish this one off. And with that in mind, we take a look at the league leaders in complete games. And as you can see there, he currently leads the AL in that department. And he's a guy looking to break out in a big way. Hasn't been getting the results he or his club have been hoping for. And he'll put this one away in foul territory for the second out. Now action in the bullpen as their closer starts to get loose out there. Darwin Barney stands in for the third time now as he takes a look at a ball. It's 1-0. Well, it should be 2-0, and oh, but he goes way out of the zone to go after that one, and it's even 1-1. One and one. Hit in the air out to center field. Kane is under it, and that retires the side. Blue Jays go down in order. They're on the short end of a one. Here's Melky Cabrera. And, Dan, what's gone wrong for this lineup today? They're only three outs away from being shut out. Boy, you know, I just haven't seen a lot of fight these at bats. Now, of course... Plenty of credit goes to that pitching, but the effort on the offensive side has been pretty lethargic watching from up here in the booth, Matt. Yeah, I would imagine it feels now the same batting. from watching in the stands in this one. Kevin Pillar Kevin. comes on Pilar. with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Heading out towards shallow right. Gordon is there. I got it. I got it. And that's the second out of the inning. Here's the third baseman, Josh Donaldson. He's their last shot here third with two away in the ninth 20. as they look to avoid the shutout. Donaldson. Yeah, Matt, they just haven't had any answer for the great pitching so far in this one. A fastball that just misses inside. And this ball runs away for ball two. Two and one. Boy, I like the pitch idea. It looked like he tried to get in the chase right there, make him think that ball's over the plate and it runs away. But he let off it. I don't know how, but he did. And that misses. So after getting two outs with three pitches, he's gone full to the third hitter here. And no chance there for Escobar. It's a base hit. So he wins the full count battle and finds a way to extend the inning. And if you're the manager, you've got to love that about your team. They were down to their last strike, but they refused to go down without a fight. So they live to fight some more. Now the Kansas City manager will make the slow walk to the mound. And a change is forthcoming as that's going to do it for his starter here this evening. So he'll depart player. with the lead and a now chance to be the winner, but he is responsible for the tying run Jesus. at first. Jesus 
Colon takes over on the mound now as he'll try to get the final out of the ball game here and pick up a save. Wow, that game flew by, but that's what happens when you get a well-pitched one-run game. Both hurlers battled, and it's almost a shame somebody had to lose this one. And that one tonight. run held up tonight, one nothing the Kansas final, number 41. A coach acknowledges a pitcher on his recent spree of strikeouts. He's on a torrid pace. They'll see if he can keep it up.